Hey, everybody. Thanks for joining me today. Uh, my name is Nick. I am a certified credit counselor with Family Credit Management. So you may have seen us on GAN TV in the past. We've been doing this for a long time. Uh, but obviously, things are a little bit different now. So we don't have, um, we're not live in studio. We're not having people call in and ask questions, but I will make sure we tell you an email address by the end of this um, where you can send in your emails, send in your questions, and somebody will answer them on the air. So it may not always be me um, that's hosting this show, uh, but we may have people, other certified credit counselors from the organization. We may have people from outside of the organization, um, some different guests, so it should be fun, and we'll uh, have a good time and hopefully provide some really good education for you. So to start off, um, I'm just going to show you a little bit of video of who we are, what we do. Um, so let me share my screen here. All right, so I'm going to play this. Debt. It can feel like a ne never-ending cycle of past due bills, high interest rates, and even collection calls. You want a way out. But most companies only deal with certain kinds of debt or offer quick fixes and even dangerous solutions that can destroy your credit and put you right back where you started. At Family Credit Management, we do things differently. First, we'll review your credit report to access who and what you owe. Then, we'll create a repayment plan that's in budget, lowers interest, and eliminates fees. We'll give you a roadmap out of debt once and for all by consolidating all your unsecured debt from all your creditors in our debt management program. You pay us once a month and we work with your creditors to take care of the rest. For over 20 years, we've been helping clients get back on track to financial independence. Now it's your turn. Get your free quote today. All right, so that was a little video about who we are, what we do, and one of the big pieces of credit counseling, it's not just signing you up on a debt management plan or um, talking to your creditors to help get some different interest rates, um, lower payments, that kind of thing. Um, what a big part of it is, is education. So we really want to be able to help set you up and our clients up for um, a debt-free future, and whether that be through um, developing a spending plan and budgeting advice or some different savings tips, uh, a personal finance course, um, developing an action plan um, with some really some actionable things that you can take and do um, that should really help you out. So throughout the years, Family Credit has developed some really good resources that you can use. They're all free of charge, no obligation. You don't have to be a client. You don't have to be talking to us about becoming a client, anything like that. So what I wanted to do today is go through and kind of give you an overview of what those are, um, how to access them for yourself, and help kind of prepare you for a better future. So let me share my screen here. All right, so this is the Family Credit homepage. It's familycredit.org. And uh, as you can see there, so from any of our website pages, all you have to do is click this, uh, this little menu icon in the top right corner of the screen, and you go to resources, and this will take you to our resources page. Um, so we've been doing this a really long time, and we're constantly trying to develop new things and figure out how we can better help people in our community. So with Obviously, everything going on with COVID-19 right now, it's uh, it's a tough time for a lot of people. There are a lot of people hurting uh, financially, more so than they were before. Um, people that weren't hurting before financially now are hurting. Um, and it's incredibly stressful, um, the whole thing. So what we did is we put together a little, a little guide um, some actionable things that you can do to maybe uh, help really leave some of that stress. Um, obviously we're not going to be able to take it all away, um, but hopefully there's something that can at least help. So if you're interested, all you got to do is click, get the guide um, and kind of go through it there. So the first thing up here is going to be our uh, personal finance made easy course. Um, so this is great. Um, 
one of the big things that people are missing a lot of times is a real um, money management education. So um, that's what this was created to help address. Um, it talks about things like establishing goals, creating a spending plan, uh, ways to realistically save money and managing bank accounts, how to begin investing. So if you wanted to go through this, it's completely self-paced. Obviously, there's not a teacher or anything, uh, but you can always reach out to us with questions. Um, you just email counseling at familycredit.org. That's counseling at familycredit.org. Um, put Can TV in the title and any questions you come up with, we'll be happy to talk about. Um, so just go ahead and click download course here and then download the guide now. So, and this is just a PDF. It, um, you can download it from your phone, download it from your computer, however you want to access it. Um, waiting for it to load. Okay, yep. So you scroll down, as you can see, it's 92 pages. So uh, it's, a, it's a time consumer. It's not something you're gonna get through all in one day. And it's not something that you should. Um, but you can go through, you can do a self-assessment, see kind of where you're at, spending, um, talks about a whole lot of different topics that you may be familiar with, some you may not be familiar with. Um, so it's a really good thing. One of my favorite ones, we're gonna go to all the way down to the end here, um, is my financial account calendar. Um, so this gives you some different things you should do each time of year once you come through it. Because a lot of this stuff kind of slips our minds. Like, um, starting a Christmas savings account in the summer. A lot of people don't do that. They try to get it all together right at the end um, or start in the fall when really doing it in summer can prepare you much, much better. Um, things like revisiting 100 Small Ways to Save, which is another one of our resources that we're going to be talking about here in just a minute. So um, that's really good when you have some time. So back at our resources page here, uh, the next one is this 100, ways to, 100 Small Ways to Save Big, which is the one we just talked about. Um, so this is great. There's a lot of different tips in here that you may not have thought of to help save some money. Um, so it's 12 different pages. There's little topics here. Uh, and it breaks it down by categories and lets you make a little commitment here. I'm going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I've already done it. Or it doesn't apply to me because let's face it, a lot of the savings tips out there don't apply to everybody all the time. In fact, rarely they apply to everybody. So there are some big ones um, that are kind of called out here, like $500 plus a month, thousand not a month, a year, $1,000 plus a year. Um, so things like that, that you can really take a look at with your family and see different places you might be able to come back or um, cut back or different places that, uh, different habits you may need to change um, that could really, really help. So after 100 small ways to save big, our next thing we have is Catherine and Elizabeth go shopping. So this is fantastic. This was uh, written by Sarah Beth. She's been with us for a very long time. Um, and we'll have her on the show here uh, sometime for sure. But, um, this is a children's book that we created um, to really help you talk to kids about money because uh, that's a really difficult conversation to have because you don't necessarily want to uh, be talking to them about your specific budget or how much money that you're making and how much money you're spending on different things. Um, so this book was designed to give that discussion a starting point. Um, and we have a whole website on it, Catherine and Elizabeth go, or Catherine and Elizabeth .com, excuse me, um, that has some different tips on how to start that conversation as well. So you can just click the link. Um, if you want to order a copy of this, uh, there's no charge for that. You just click get your copy, fill out a little form, and we'll send you one in the mail. Uh, we'd be glad to do that. So the personal spending plan. This one's great. A lot of people like this because uh, budgeting can be a really scary word for a lot of people. Uh, and a lot of people just don't know how to do it. And that's okay. It's not something that's taught regularly. Um, and one of the biggest things that people don't do when they're trying to create a budget is write it down. Um, 
they really try to do it in their head a lot or they jot down a few notes here and there, um, but they don't do it very thoroughly. They miss a lot of things. Um, so we created the My Spending Plan to really help out with that. So again, this is something that you can just go and download on your own. Um, you don't have to be a client or anything. Um, it talks about good places to start uh, and things you need. So hell, it talks about setting goals, which is huge. Um, you can budget, but if you're not setting any goals, well, what are you working towards? Um, you want to pay off those credit cards or you want to save up for college tuition or uh, you want to pay off some medical bills or you want to buy a new car or buy a new TV, whatever the goal is. Um, you need to write those goals down, um, make them realistic. And this kind of talks a lot about that kind of stuff. Um, so it goes through, it helps you determine your income, um, breaks it down by category, has some tips for freeing up some extra cash. Um, has a place for you to list all your different credit cards and store card, bank and store cards. Um, so you can really visualize everything. Um, some different categories on how much you should be spending for each category for the average family. Um, it's not gonna be exactly the same for everybody, but these are some really good goals to have. Um, expenses. So a lot of these things people don't really um, necessarily think of like they're not thinking about all of the different subscriptions they have or the amount they tie of the church or donate to um, charities or how much fuel or they're not including routine maintenance stuff that they might do quarterly or something um, so make sure you break that all down and fill that out thoroughly um, it gives you some tips on what you can maybe do um, to help improve it um, some things you can do with your savings, uh, looking at some different investment stuff. So it's really, really um, got a personal inventory list here. So this is a really, really good resource, um, especially if you're not super well versed in budgeting savings yourself. So, and then we have a bunch of different financial calculators on here. So um, rolling down credit card debt, uh, should your spouse be working in student spending calculator, retirement plan, or all sorts of stuff. Um, so that's really good. You can go in there um, and tie that back in with the, um, help you set those goals for the spending plan and for your budget um, to really figure out what you need to be doing to help yourself out. Um, so, and if you're ready to get started, you can call this number right here, 877-322-8319. Um, um, it's a toll free number. Um, if you want to talk to somebody, it doesn't, you don't even have to be interested in our program, but if you want to talk to somebody about uh, just budgeting and um, getting some tips and taking a look at your credit and seeing where, where, where you can improve and what you can do, um, are happy to do that for you. Um, or if you wanted to get a free quote, you just click get started with a free quote um, and that's it. So. Um, a couple other interesting things on the website here um, is the how serious is my debt? So this is a quiz that kind of helps figure out um, some problem areas that you may have or it, some really good areas you may have if you're doing really well. Um, so things like how many late fees have you been charged in the last 60 days? How many credit cards are you over the limit on? Um, are you receiving collection calls? Are you behind on your mortgage? Do you have payday loans? Things like that. So, um, and then once you fill this out, you'll get, if you put your email, um, you see the results, uh, you can have somebody contact you to help talk to you about it, really kind of help determine what your situation is. Is it that bad? Could it be better? Um, everybody's situation could be better, let's be honest, but uh, is it panic time? Uh, so if you're not quite sure, if you're trying to put it off, this is a good thing to kind of see where you're at. Um, so licensing we've got we're licensed all over the place um, everywhere that requires it all the different states around the country um, work in them and we have a frequently asked questions page here which this doesn't it doesn't all apply to our debt management program a lot of it does um, but it, it talks about some different options. So um, there's debt settlement, it talks about that, um, talks about the differences between this and bankruptcy. Um, should I get a loan instead of using debt management services? So that kind of thing is uh, something that you may 
be considering, but and we'll talk about those different options in depth uh, in future episodes for sure, like bankruptcy versus settlement versus consolidation loans versus a debt management program. Because um, let's be honest, there's so much out there and who knows necessarily what's right for you besides you and your exact situation because um, it's different for everybody. So once again, um, if you wanted to get in touch with us, you can call us at 877-322-8319, toll free. Um, We'd be happy to talk to you, um, talk to our counselors. Um, Otherwise, what uh, you can do is email counseling, uh, counseling at familycredit.org and just put CANTV in the subject line and we'll definitely be sure to um, review that and make sure we talk about those topics in a future episode. So that's all I really have for you today on the first episode here. Um, I know that uh, it was a really brief overview of kind of the, some of the resources we offer, but I sure hope that it'll help. Um, and just, I hope everybody is staying safe. Hope your families are staying safe and uh, please reach out to us. If you do need anything, or you do have any questions that you want us to cover in the future, uh, we'd love to hear from you. Once again, that's counseling at familycredit.org. Um, I will certainly be back with you on can TV here. Um, we'll have some other people here on can TV um, and we're really looking forward to it and kind of providing you some help where we can. Um, so yeah, thank you very much everybody and have a really great day.